Saturn is the second largest planet in our solar system, and it orbits nearly a billion miles away from the Sun. Saturn is surrounded by rings of ice, rock, and dust, and it has at least 62 moons in orbit around it. Saturn is a gigantic ball of gases, mostly hydrogen and helium, with a sprinkling of other chemicals. As Saturn spins, its outer clouds do not move as one blanket, but instead circle in wind patterns seen as stripes. Saturn's inside are still cooling down, and heat slowly bubbles up from below, coloring the stripes gold and beige and introducing occasional storms that are seen as bright white swirls. To our radio telescopes, this escaping heat makes Saturn appear very bright, and we can see beneath Saturn's cloud layers. When measured up close by robotic spacecraft, the pattern of radio waves also helps us to measure the speed that the gases are moving around the planet. That gives us a good estimate of the speed that Saturn is spinning. Underneath its 36,000 miles of atmosphere, Saturn may have a small solid core. On top of that core are huge oceans of liquid hydrogen. Saturn's deepest hydrogen ocean has become metallic under the incredible pressure of the layers of hydrogen above it. The metallic hydrogen ocean acts like a huge electromagnet as it churns, creating a large magnetic field spreading out around Saturn. Any particles that get trapped in this field give off radio waves. And if the particles ride the magnetic field lines into the atmosphere of Saturn, they make aurorae that give off even more radio waves. The greatest suppliers of these particles are the Sun and three of Saturn's moons. The Sun's varying stream of charged particles, known as the solar wind, smashes into Saturn's magnetic field all day and night, causing the aurorae on Saturn. Saturn's moon Dione has an icy surface that is bombarded by Saturn's powerful radiation, causing its ice molecules to burst into hydrogen and oxygen atoms that are then free to leave the moon's surface, get caught in the magnetic field, and emit radio waves. Eruptions of water and gas from Saturn's geyser moon, Enceladus, create Saturn's E-ring and also emit radio waves when they become trapped in Saturn's magnetic field.